hot dog? Ooh. Shit. Popped it inside the gym even. Relax the hand. Yup. Relax them. Yup. All right, we're doing Smith machines today. Um, we did do a warm up on the incline prior to this, but we're not counting that as anything working. Uh, now on the Smith machine, two things. Come here. We got these pins all set up at a location to where I cannot touch my chest. Almost like a floor bench. Uh, we're gonna come down, moderately hold it or relax it on the pins and back up. Smith's machine is a great machine to use. Um, mostly in today's society, I don't know why uh, most people or strong guys go away from the Smith machine. Uh, it's a weak exercise. Listen guys, it's, you do a lot more weak things than this. So jump this in there. This is also great for you guys that are traveling. Hotels usually only have a Smith machine. So here's your exercise for that. Yeah, I, I pause it, relax, and then flex out of it. Uh, the reason why for me is the connection. Also, I need to re... I'm always safe, but today I gotta be overly safe uh, because I'm water depleted. So that's even tougher when you're, when you're training at this stage. Most people, which I agree with, don't train heavy that last week before the show. I'm on stage tomorrow, so this is one of those things where, again, I like doing it this way, and I've been able to do it well enough and safe enough to do it. So that's another reason why I'm doing it. Now, let's say you're not dieting, you're not, not this extreme as I am right now. The great thing about this would be, it's such a safe exercise to do. You're loaded, you're not gonna get stuck under it. And uh, the connection, mind to muscle connection on a Smith machine is unreal. Let's go. position in a, in a bad way with the Smith machine because you can't control the bar path. I know, I know some, oh. people, some people think that I see what you're machine. saying. Wow. I could understand that. Yeah. We just correct yourself. Just, right. Yeah. Um, but I understand that there's no give or take. Um, great point on their part. Yeah, I, I could see that. Like on a hammer machine or a Smith machine, you're locked in on your seat and stuff, and then you're pressing, so it kind of forms to that position to where there's no wiggle room. Right. I understand that, but uh, yeah, I, if there's going to be something that maybe you get a hiccup on or get into a locked position, I would say don't push through that locked position if that happens, because that's your body trying to signal there's a, there's a hiccup in the system. Yeah. There's a bump in the system. Don't push through that bump. That's a real smart point to, to make sure you don't get injured. I think that's a, that's a smart thing to do. But what I like on that set when you saw Doc, Doc could release, move, and before he restarted, he was right in the perfect position again. Then he relaxed, moved, 
right back into it. Even though it was a fast movement, it was right back into that proper position. And I like that he could do that. He's been doing it over and over and over again. Hey guys, uh, Smith Machine. Again, great exercise, great machine, sorry. Um, and so much can be used and done on it correctly in a great way. That was uh, one of my favorites. Again, a pin press is a beautiful exercise to do. Um, we're gonna bring a lot more of these as we do this, because I do want to show you squats on here, some shoulder press on here. Uh, yeah, I'm excited, I'm excited. So, and also I'll pop the top more, and so you can kind of see how the muscles actually activate through the exercises.